More than 90% of Taiwan's businesses are small and medium-sized enterprises, meaning the resources they can invest in R&D tend to be limited. To promote innovation, the Ministry of Economic Affairs and the Taiwan Electrical and Electronic Manufacturers Association on Wednesday held a matchmaking event for businesses to find the technology solutions they need. The main focus points were the artificial intelligence of things and chip applications, advanced manufacturing processes and display technologies, and smart vehicles and green energy. More than 40 technologies were showcased at the event in hopes of helping SMEs find just what they need. This robotic arm is equipped with sensors and artificial intelligence technologies to accurately retrieve items from a disorganized box. This tech could be used to help sort items in logistic systems. This clear display on the right shows a nightscape of Type A101, but the image in the buildings look quite blurry. That can be solved by harnessing low diffraction and anti-yellowing technologies, as is the case for the clear screen on the left. It shows Type A101 in high resolution and colours close to what the human eye would see. In the future, the tech could be implemented in tour buses or at the top of tall buildings to show what's in the vicinity in the city. As many as 98% of Taiwan's businesses are small and medium-sized enterprises with limited resources to invest in R&D. The Ministry of Economic Affairs and the Taiwan Electrical and Electronic Manufacturers Association work together to hold a matchmaking event for technology providers. The main focus points were the artificial intelligence of things and chip applications, advanced manufacturing processes and display technologies and smart vehicles and green energy. All in all, 40 innovative technologies were showcased at the event. We have built up a collection of more than 1,000 tech breakthroughs. Businesses voice their needs and we connect them with the things they need to upgrade their industrial technology capabilities. Legal entities under the Ministry of Economic Affairs and especially ETRI, the Metal Industries Research and Development Center, the Automotive Research and Testing Center and the Precision Machinery Research and Development Center are full of experts. This event allows SMEs to be exposed to new technologies. Following a matchmaking meeting held with Honhai last year, this time the Economics Ministry has teamed up with the Taiwan Electrical and Electronic Manufacturers Association. The event attracted R&D directors from more than 300 companies. Through their discussions, they aim to find tech solutions to meet the needs of small and medium-sized enterprises while promoting industrial innovation.